Alright guys, this is Metro Last Light. This is the second game of the Metro uh, series. Um, the first one was great, man. I love it. And if you guys haven't seen the game, I have it on my channel. So just look that up. But I'm definitely going to start this one. So let's just hop right into it. I'm excited, guys. From the garden's direction. The Dark Ones, huge, towering a full head over the highest man. Nightmarish creatures, creepy as a man turned inside out. Monsters born to destroy us. The word was they were incredibly strong and unnaturally evil. That with bare paws they could tear armed men apart. Joseph. That's all lies. Truth is even scarier. All right, guys, here we go. Well, I used to live nearby. Before the war, I mean, uh, up there. I was on the train when it happened. I tried calling my family, but couldn't get through. What the? I like it already. I already jumped into the action. Imagine you killed your own men. Artyom, wake up, Artyom. It's me, Carl. Nightmares, eh? No wonder, after all you've been through. Listen, I have incredible news. A couple of days ago, I was near the ruins of the Dark One's hive, and I saw one of them, still alive. I immediately set out to find you, as you were the one they tried to contact. Before you launched the missile strike against them. Carl! How the hell did you get here? Get out! Now! Yes, Ullman, one moment. If a Dark One has survived, it is vital that you try to speak with it, Artyom. I realize that, as one of the Order now, you report to Miller. But we must persuade him to allow this mission. Carl! I told you to get out! This is a classified base. You shouldn't even be here. I'll take you to Colonel Miller. Follow me, Artyom. Get ready, Artyom. I'll be waiting at the exit. Move it, you windbag! I knew a smoker once. During the last year of his life, he had to eat, drink, and breathe for a tiny hole in his throat. Alright guys, so I remember that guy from the first game, Lance, look at this dude jamming out bro, alright, well let me uh, let me fix the sensitivity real quick, I know I had to turn it up pretty high uh, in the last game so, yeah it's a little, a little better. Artyom was one of the men who found D6. They gave him a ranger's badge on the spot. Yeah, that's nice for him. I had to spend two years as a cadet before they accepted me into the order. Well, anyway, uh, where were we? D6 said that? No, they couldn't reach it in time. It's still a few years. 
Come on, you have five more sets of 30. Look at those two rookies. Pathetic. Doing no wonder the carrier or the training that double. So he's brought his son through the marshes to the George base. And Romanov's the only one who makes it. Hello, Artyom. Welcome to the armory. I hear you're a ranger now, huh? We must get a drink sometime to celebrate. For now, let's get you equipped. So, first things first. You're going to need a gas mask. You can't make a step on the surface without yeah. a gas mask. It's been 20 years and the radiation still strong enough in some places to boil water. There are hot spots down here in the metro, too. Don't forget filters for the mask. Sure, it looks cool enough even without these, but they definitely make it better for your health. Now, med kits. Well, what can I say? Anything you need for survival in a stylish orange case. Here's your advanced salary for this month. Remember, your pay is in military-grade rounds. Sure, you can use them as usual ammo for some hefty extra damage, but saving them to buy guns, attachments, regular ammo and equipment from merchants anywhere in the metro seems like a smarter move. Yep, just like the, uh, the first game. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Alright, now to the good stuff, huh? Let's get you some guns. Take the ones you want and try them out on my range. Am I supposed to, uh... Rangers usually carry up to three weapons, Artyom, and the choice of those is completely up to you. Ah, good choice. I'm definitely gonna need a... Push for this. Ah. Shotguns are always good for stopping close range. <laughs> Yeah, let's go get it. Wait and fully off the mark. You can see the round from the clip, but it overheats and its accuracy is shit. were filled with whatever they might need in the afterlife. Weapons, gold, chariots. They'd sacrifice their wives and slaves to serve their lords even in death. Reminds me of this banker. Cut that shit out! <laughs> the things in D6 are like what the Conqueror took with him beyond the grave. Gold steel, and wild steeds, and treasures untold. Whoa, 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 of course, hey, the Tomb Raiders would always die horribly, 
killed by demons or ghosts, or their own greed. Come, will you shut up or what? Okay, I heard that Lesnitsky did something. What happened? Nobody knows. Lesnitsky was at the lab. When the next shift came, the door was open and the lab ransacked. Lesnitsky was gone. Shit. So, what's inside? Chemical weapons, maybe some other shit. That's, that's all I heard. God damn it. The colonel's going to tear me a new one because of Lesnitsky. A red hot poker right into my soul. If I still have one. All right, let's go. We might control T6, but it's like a damn city down there. All the bunkers, the nooks and crannies and exits. Still, they based the order dreamed of finding. The guys just came back from the ring. They say Hansa is strengthening the sentry points along the whole line, especially the ones close to the Nazis. Kruman, take these guys to Miller. They've been summoned. Yes, sir. All right, go on in. I'll wait here. When you've gone, I'll speak to Miller. The bombing of the Dark Ones may have been humanity's worst mistake. What if they meant us no harm, but were trying to communicate? Perhaps the severe pain and loss of consciousness suffered in their presence just meant we were incompatible. Machines with different wiring. Somehow you, Artyom, have the common wire, the connection with the Dark Ones. Yes, people died at Exhibition, your home station. Hunter, the best of the Order, is most likely dead as well. And he taught you this. If we don't fight for our lives in this new world, we'll be devoured. It is the law of evolution. But I would argue, the old laws no longer apply. Okay, so if you guys have not played the first one, this room is in the very end of the game. Right. Thought I'd share that with you guys. And you, God, you have something to report? Yes, Colonel. Let's keep it short. I located the surviving Dark One at the gardens. What? One of those things is still alive? Luckily, yes. Luckily? Come, this is utter madness. The Dark Ones were the greatest threat the Orders ever faced. Kongo, just give me a chance. A single Dark One is no threat. Artyom has a gift. I believe he can establish contact with the creature. Let him come with me. All right. Artyom. Go with Khan to the gardens, and locate the Dark One. I'll send a sniper along. My best. Anna! Yes, sir. Why would we need a sniper? To eliminate the creature, and finish the Order's job! Miller, you can't! It's murder! Restrain him! You idiot! You're making the same mistake that- We're done here. Escort Khan out of here. Artyom! It's your last chance for forgiveness, for getting rid of the nightmares! Forget about Khan. Looks like he got close, too close to the creature and lost his mind. Look here, Artyom. Complete the mission and get back here quickly. A war is coming and I'll need every ranger at his post. Now on your way. So, what are you waiting for? Come along, rabbit. So, uh... If it's true that the Dark Ones can sense you, maybe you could draw it out from hiding so Anna could have a clear shot. But do me a favor. Don't let the Dark One get into your mind, or Anna will have two targets. Is that understood? We yeah. now suspect Lesnitsky was a sleeper agent, but we haven't verified who's right. Your job is to intercept him before... What if the dude's right? <laughs> Don't tell me you believe that bullshit about making peace with the Dark Ones. Hey, I wish I had been up in that tower myself to see the missiles fall and watch them burn in their nests. Come on, Rabbit. Would you let those things into the Metro? 
Let them crawl into our brains so they could use us like animals. Maybe we could mate with them, so the children could live on the surface and feed off the radiation. Shit. You don't shake hands with the devil. Please step away from the edge of the platform. Train coming in. Alright, hop in like a good little rabbit. Why is she calling me rabbit? <laughs> well, we've worn this place out. Let's move. Just a year ago, I stood on top of the TV tower and saw missiles rain on the botanical gardens, turning the flesh into ashes, smelting metal and glass. Nobody and nothing could survive that inferno. Yet Khan did find a dark one there. Now my mission is to find and eliminate it. To finish what I started. In the past, trains were ordinary things. But now, this monorail seems magic, doesn't it? Our kids won't know how to operate these things. And their kids will probably think this was built by the gods. Yeah, so the first game was pretty sweet, man. I enjoyed playing it. Move, I'm following. Go right. There's a dead end on the left. Something alarmed them. Stay sharp. Yep. Shit, that thing's fast. Here we go. I don't think we'll run into anything serious here. Great, the ladder. It's just a little more walking. Then we'll see if you're a rabbit or a man. Surface, put your mask on. I just tried to. This isn't my first rodeo. Quit looking at my ass. It's way out of your reach, rabbit. Wow. Did she really just say that? God. God bless America. Give me a hand here. At least it's not snowing like last time, you know. Let's go to the main entrance. Last There's time everything was covered in there. snow. I can cover a lot of territory. You're supposed to be immune to there. What? Influence? Well, I don't have your gift. So hop along, rabbit. 
Head on in and look for the creature. I'm thinking that since the Dark Ones are so fond of you, it'll sense you, or smell you, or whatever the fuck they do, and come from hiding. Just try to stay in the open so I can cover you. We'll maintain radio contact. And if you have second thoughts, don't worry. I'll do it. Okay then. Good luck. Alright, splitting up. Oh man, well, I don't know how I feel about this, guys. Oh, there's those flying things. I'm in position. I can see you. Something's still burning where the nest was. That's some fine wasteland. You guys sure did a good job here. It's strange. What could still be burning after all this time? I see some kind of movement. Get ready. On the right. I'm working on them. Those are the They're watchmen. That health was bad luck. Get ready for more. Another three. Let's do it. Look, there's one This Am I supposed to be shooting this thing or what? The creature I met in the burnt out remains of the gardens looks like a dark one. And it was able to enter my mind, dragging the innermost out of me. But it was also just a baby. And I am sure that it recognized me. And got scared. It also left me knocked out for some time. Just enough for me to get captured. Alright guys, I think that's it for this one. Uh, I like making the first videos long, but in this case, I don't know if I should. But I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in my next one.